Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and today I have a couple of VRs to share with you guys. So I'm just going to go ahead and jump right in. So this one is for what Lizzie presents and she's hosting a birthday challenge and she's pretty much asking just crafter's choice. So I ended up finally using these little um, wooden pieces that I had from AliExpress. I forgot what they're called. They kind of look like the little mini embroidery hoops. And so I just decorated it in Maggie Holmes. I also have this, I believe it's my last one. I finally used it. Um, my little swan there um, that I got from Allie as well. And it matches her collection pretty well. So I went ahead and just embellished it with some flowers. Added that little organza bow. I did include a little clip here. I'm not sure if I'm going to add a tiny little charm or just leave it as is. And then she can pretty much use it to what she wants and then I did a little version here so I think it's so cute I added some paper flowers some little gems some gold thread absolutely adorable so I will leave her link down below um, I believe it goes to the middle of or the first or two weeks of December so there is some time to still join if you want to and again it's crafters choice and she leaves all the information in her video so I will leave her video link in my description box and then the next one I want to share is for um, it's paper and glue y'all and this is Giselle and she's requesting a memory decks card She is hosting a 100 Sebi challenge. She just reached 100 and in order to celebrate she's asking um, For you guys to send in a memory decks card in any style or theme that you want um, so This is what I did again. I went kind of Maggie Holmes vibe. I did use an embellishment that I created um, a while back and so I went ahead and used that as like my focal point and then I had a gold do uh, yellow doily and then I had this really pretty butterfly that was in my stash gifted to me and um, some happy mail and then I went ahead and used a crepe paper rosette underneath and then just added some little they kind of look like mini little buttons, but they are stickers. And I just added that little sentiment that says perfectly charming. And I think it turned out really pretty. I do have my information in the back. So that is the memory dex card that I created for her. So you guys can go check her out if you guys like to do that and uh, let her know that I sent you. And the other two that I'm going to be mentioning, um, they are just requesting cards. So there is my world in OKC. She's requesting either a non occasion, occasion uh, card or a birthday card. She's going to be um, giving them out. I think um, at the rest homes. I think that's what she said. Um, so she's just asking for that. So you just want to leave them blank inside. But um, yeah, just asking for cards. So I will leave her link down below if you guys want to join that. Super easy. And she's giving away a big like sticker book. It's pretty cool. It has lots of different floral images. And it's really neat. So if you're interested in that, um, you can join her challenge. And then the other one is Rosemary's You Rock Art. She is also requesting handmade birthday cards um yeah hers is specific birthday cards they do have to be handmade and she does list um the size and actually with both of those challenges I have cards that were gifted to me during my birthday challenge that um people know that they left blank because I'm not a huge card maker so anytime I receive a card and it's left blank inside it makes my life so much easier especially when challenges like this come around because I I have some in my stash and I don't have to stress about making any. So that is her challenge. So I will leave all the four links down below. Let them know that I sent you if you aren't familiar with their channel. And check out their challenges if you guys want to join and win some cool prizes. Alright guys, I will see you in my next one. Take care. Bye.